How do cultural expectations influence the diversity of sexual experiences? What do studies say about fidelity in relationships? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. Cultural expectations impact the diversity of sexual experiences by influencing norms, gender roles, and attitudes towards sexuality. These expectations shape communication, sexual education, and acceptance of sexual diversity, contributing to either a more inclusive or restrictive view of sexual experiences. Studies on fidelity in relationships indicate that infidelity is a common phenomenon, but rates vary. Factors such as communication, satisfaction in the relationship, and commitment can influence fidelity. Group sex fantasies. Group sex fantasies involve sexual encounters with multiple people at the same time, whether in threesomes, orgies, or gangbangs. These fantasies can be explored through imagination or consensually in real life. Hormonal effect on desire. Sex hormones, such as testosterone and estrogen, play a key role in sexual desire. Changes in hormonal levels can affect libido. Impact on quality of life. Premature ejaculation can have a significant impact on men's and their partner's quality of life, affecting sexual satisfaction, self-esteem, and overall mental health. Impact on the relationship. Premature ejaculation can create tensions in the couple's relationship, especially if not addressed properly. Open communication and mutual understanding are crucial for overcoming this challenge. Importance of foreplay. Foreplay, including kissing, caressing, and other forms of erotic stimulation, is crucial for increasing sexual arousal and preparing the body for sexual intercourse. Importance of safe sex. Practicing safe sex, including the use of condoms and other contraceptive methods, is essential for preventing unwanted pregnancies and sexually transmitted diseases. Importance of sexual self-care. Sexual self-care involves taking steps to protect sexual and emotional health, including the use of contraceptives, STD screening, and establishing healthy boundaries in sexual relationships. Increase in vulnerable populations. Groups such as men who have sex with men, sex workers, people who use intravenous drugs, and those without access to health care are more susceptible to contracting STDs due to social, economic, and behavioral factors. In some indigenous communities in Latin America, rituals and traditional ceremonies are practiced that include teachings about sexuality and reproduction as an integral part of culture and spirituality. Influence of alcohol on sex. Alcohol can affect sexual function in various ways. While it may lower inhibitions, excessive alcohol can hinder erection in men and arousal in women. Influence of food on sex. Some foods are considered aphrodisiacs due to their supposed ability to increase sexual desire. Popular examples include chocolate, oysters, and avocado. Influence of technology on sexuality. Technology has changed how people experience sexuality. Online connected applications and sexual toys are examples of how technology has integrated into modern sexual life. Inspiration for experimentation. The detailed illustrations and descriptions of the Kama Sutra have inspired many couples to experiment with new techniques and sexual positions, which can revitalize the sex life and increase emotional connection between partners. Intensity and passion. For some women, sexual positions involving a higher degree of intensity and passion, such as the screw or acrobat position, can be especially exciting. In the cultural context of some East Asian countries like Japan and South Korea, sex education may be taboo and limited due to the influence of conservative social norms and a culture of modesty. Kama Sutra in Cinema Movies and documentaries explore the theme of the Kama Sutra, offering visual representations of its teachings and its impact on different cultures and eras. 
Caretza is a sexual practice that focuses on emotional and spiritual intimacy rather than orgasm. It encourages deep and prolonged connection between partners. Kink culture, BDESM, bondage, discipline, dominance, submission, sadism, and masochism is a sexual subculture involving consensual erotic practices and games. For many, BDSM is a way to explore fantasies and boundaries. Late sexual awakening. Some individuals experience a late sexual awakening in adulthood, meaning they develop a heightened interest in sexuality after years of little or no interest. Leather and latex fetishism. This fetish involves an attraction to the use of leather, latex, or vinyl garments, either as a form of dress in sexual contexts or as part of specific role-playing scenarios. Legal and social recognition. Although open relationships are gaining acceptance, they are still not legally recognized in many places, which can complicate aspects such as child custody or partner benefits. Love and sexual desire. Romantic love and sexual desire are two different aspects of a relationship. While love focuses on emotional connection, sexual desire involves physical attraction. Male anorgasmia, anorgasmia, the difficulty in reaching orgasm, can also affect some men. It can be caused by emotional or physical factors and may be treated with sexual therapy. Masturbation and empowerment. For many women, masturbation is a form of sexual empowerment by taking control of their own pleasure and exploring their sexuality without shame or taboos. Masturbation as part of sexuality. Masturbation is a common and healthy way to explore sexuality and provide oneself with pleasure. Although it has often been stigmatized, masturbation can be a safe and satisfying practice in the context of healthy sexuality. Masturbation. During menstrual cycle, some women find that masturbation can alleviate symptoms of premenstrual syndrome, PMS, and menstrual cramps by releasing endorphins and reducing muscle tension. Masturbation in the elderly. Masturbation is not limited to young women. Many older women continue to enjoy masturbation as part of their sexual life and overall well-being. Medical fetishism. Medical fetishism involves sexual attraction to medical scenarios, uniforms, or instruments. This can include role-playing where one person assumes the role of doctor or patient, exploring the sensuality and vulnerability associated with medical care. Mental preparation. Mental preparation is crucial for a positive experience. Open communication and trust between partners can significantly contribute to emotional comfort. In Mexico, online and social media-based sexual education campaigns targeting teenagers have been created using language and visual content adapted to their youth culture to address sexuality topics in an accessible and relevant way. Mobile applications. There are mobile applications dedicated to the Kama Sutra that offer interactive guides, tips, and tutorials on different sexual positions and techniques to enhance intimacy in couples. MRI studies. MRI studies have shown that the brain areas activated during orgasm are similar in both genders, suggesting that the experience is more similar than previously thought. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality.